to another one of my videos. This is going to be a short video of my new project, which is the Steel Weasel Airbox. It's been a little project that I've had in my, in my head for quite a while to do because I can see there's a problem with Lambrettas and air filter systems and, and air filters, remote filters, you name it, nothing works correctly. So it's time that got sorted out. Right, I've got a new project in the making. This one is going to be working in conjunction with another YouTube channel. A YouTube channel that specializes in CAD design on three, Fusion 360. And uh, we're looking at 3D printer work. I've been working on air filter shapes and air filter designs now for a while, mainly in my head. Now we've got a few drawings done and sketches and the idea is to redesign a Lambretta filter, one that actually works with bigger carbs. So far I've just been doing some preliminary sketches uh, up against the bike of the back plate of the airbox which is going to be fitted with these struts to take screws. It's going to be a two piece box. The air intake will be at the rear. Uh, it's going to have a cutaway here, this was uh, thought about. This will be cut away here and flowed over the flywheel. This section will be removed. Uh, we'll come across that. We did think about having an option for a, uh, an, an optional hose from the top, but I decided against that. So the airbox is going to be basically this size with the trumpet coming towards the rear of the bike to get fresh air, as much fresh air in as possible. And that's our kind of design. We took a few measurements and now it's going on to uh, the 3D process uh, on Fusion 360 and that you'll be watching this weekend. So a lot of people have been using these uh, remote filters. This one, this design with the wider bellows here it's probably one of the be best of the bunch, but it still has problems on hot starts where it tends to flood the engine because you always, always get a build up of fuel on the walls of the rubber inside this. And that means when the engine's hot, it doesn't want to restart. So what we're going to do is, I'm designing an air box that fits inside here, that's going to take its air from the back here so it's going to get cool air for coming up from behind the engine not up through the top here like the original feeding through this box here we wanted we're doing away with that we're designing a whole new air filter that fits in here it's going to enhance airflow into the flywheel so it's going to enhance your cooling it's going to have better flow into the carburetor and better fuel and better filtering so the whole thing is going to fit in here nice and neat and it's all going to be done on a 3D printer. So if this is something you're really interested in, I'll be work doing the first basic uh, design work this weekend in my new video which will come out probably on Sunday. So tune back in on Sunday and see what we're doing. In the meantime, I've got some work.